Hello everybody, my name is Anil coming from Essence of Zen. Today we're going to do a quick review on these weird, very weird pair of glasses. You're watching Pseudo Up Owns the Word. So in my hands right here are a pair of glasses. These are the East Vista Watch Repair glasses that feature two magnifying spy glasses for each eye and they're pretty much powered at about 20x magnification. So if you're, if you know anything more about magnifications or any types of uh, measurement, it's pretty much 20x which goes to about 80D which stands for uh, diopter or dioptry, depending on if you're from the US or the UK. Now, these glasses actually work relatively well for their purposes, aside from one of the frames being really loose, but aside from that, they actually do work pretty well, but only for one eye at a time. The fact that their focal lengths are so low and, and pretty much weak, you have to have the item nearly up close to the frames or to the actual lenses to get any effect from them. Because of this, the stereoscopic ability is pretty much impossible. When you have an item so close to one of the lenses, the other eye is literally looking at either nothing or a very blurred image. Would anyone want to buy these? Sure, because they're really cheap, about $5 depending on your location. On Amazon, they do come with LED flashes which helps out when you're probably soldering or looking at some type of minor details for any objects or items. But generally speaking, you don't want to use them as glasses. What you want to do is pretty much separate the lenses from the, the frame. And if you want to check out that video, you can probably find it over here somewhere to go ahead and click it and watch it. And I'll actually take you step by step in removing the lenses from the frames. And that way you can have two Monocles used for uh, magnifying hardware, tech, watches, which is what these are actually made for, watch repair, uh, and etc. So if you want to buy these, we'll have a link in the description below. Um, I really don't recommend you buy them. You might be just better off buying a better type of magnifying glass. But if you want to buy them for some type of costume, steampunk, cosplay, um, I will be sure to link them in the description below. So if you have any questions about these devices, feel free to leave them in the comment section below. Subscribe if you want to see more. Uh, I will see you in the next video, but until then, as always, take care.